This video will show you how to make a three column supply and demand scatter graph using Excel 2007. I recorded the video first so the sound may not match up with the picture. Sorry. Okay. Normally you may you may only have a price and a demand graph. A, two, a simple two column graph is simple as can be. You simply just select price, hold down shift and select the last one. Next you'll go to insert, scatter under graphs there and hit smooth scatter graph and bada bing bada boom you will have the y axis and the x axis. And if you just want to switch the x and y column all you have to do is just simply switch the price and quantity demand and there you go. But now it's a little more complicated for a three column graph. We have price, quantity demand, and quantity supply. You do the same thing, you hold down shift and highlight the whole thing. Go to insert, graphs, scatter, smooth scatter, and there you have it. Simple as that. Wrong. The, if you notice, the x and y axis are different. You want the price to be on the y axis and the quantities to be on the x axis. So how do you switch this? Relatively simple. You just simply right click, hit select data, select the QD first, and then edit. You can then change, you will change the QD to just simply change it to demand. And then if you notice the X value is highlighted over here and the Y column will be highlighted as well. And you need to just simply switch that. So simply select the X column there, highlight it, and get rid of it. And then you just simply go to Quantity to Demand, select it, highlight down to the last column there, and there you go. That switches it and then you simply do this opposite there. For the Y value, you take the price, highlight it, and there you have it. Your graph may look funny, but don't worry about that. Now we will change the quantity supply. Do the same thing. Change the QS to supply, and then change the X and Y values. Select the X value. Once again, if you notice, it's highlighted price there as an X value and then you select the quantity supply is highlighted for the Y value. Don't get rid of it. Select quantity supply, highlight it. Next, do the same thing here. Quantity under price, highlight it. Switch it. OK. OK again. There you have it. You have the graph that has price on the Y axis and quantities on the X axis. Now, if you want to add a title to either the graph up here or titles to the X and Y axis, all you simply do is go to under chart tools there, layout, chart titles, or in this case, I will use title access titles. Horizontal, there you go. Just simply type in what you need. I'll make it quantity. And then you do the same thing for the horizontal axis. You could choose it how it will look exactly, but I'll do it just sideways there, rotated. And I will name it price. And there you have it. You can drag the graph over underneath the column. Go ahead, hit print preview. If you have the graph showing and you want the column, just unselect it. There you go. But if you want to print it, with, print it with a grid, just go page setup, sheet, grid lines, OK, and print. And then you are good to go. That is how you can switch the X and Y axis in a supply and demand graph on Excel 2007.